That's just a proper piece of, of rib, isn't it? Are you really gonna do that? I'm gonna do it, yeah. Hello everyone, welcome back to Food Review Club. We are in Chelmsford and it is chuffing, freezing. God, I think I'll just key the car with my nipples. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing great. We have, we have snow. It's no problem, we're gonna crack on. Now, where am I and what am I reviewing? Burgers, wings, and ribs. Yeah, you heard that right. We're back here for the third time. First time, we got invited down to the open night of the bus. Loved it. Like, that's, that video was a vibe. I think you remember me in a nice shirt. And then we went to Ipswich, because they had another bus, and I had, wanted to try more food from the incredible menu. And now, They've got their first high street premises that's opening on Friday today. This video is going to go out. This video is also filmed on a Tuesday. They're doing some test food. And invite me down again. Why not? And look, I'm going to be honest with you as well. Come in, cut us the coast, guys. I need to level with one. I came here the other day and had some wings from somewhere else. I won't talk about it. That is the only time, just we agree with this, the video's gone out and I, I instantly regretted the score. I had to change my trousers afterwards. <laughs> It was a not car crash. Yeah, not for good. <laughs> no, we had, we had grease accident everywhere. The car had to go. The car had to go in for a full valet because it smelt like disgustingness. So I'm here. Probably my favourite uh, North Essex food: burgers, wings, and ribs. And you wait till you see what I've got here. It's like I'm the official tester for the brand. I got a 9.3 last time. I love it. The guys are crackers, and um, you want to see the food. Right. Hopefully, <laughs> I wreck the food. Disclaimer, I'm not paid for any of this food. We're going to be completely upfront and honest. I'm the official tester. What do you expect? <laughs> so this is in here. Look, look, look. We're gonna, you're going to see a feast on your hands here now. I'll tell you. Burgers, wings and ribs, we've got all three of them. Ready? <laughs> Aye, look at this! This is called the Triple Cheese Wrecker. 12 ounces of meat, halloumi on top, cheese. I actually um, filmed them making this. It was like dirty dancing. <laughs> Amazing. I had to change my trousers again. <laughs> right, let's dive into this. This is, as is my lovely holy burger, 100% brisket meat. You cannot beat brisket meat for the flavour. That's actually got a really nice texture to it as well. That's the inside. Mm. That halloumi on top gives it this extra. It's the triple cheese wrecker. It tastes really cheesy. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Halloumi gives it something extra. It's got any sauce in there? It's got a cheese sauce on top of it as well. Oh, really? It tastes like some kind of sweet, got sweet ketchup underneath. Sometimes the simple ones are the best. But the city knows all about this food. I don't need to keep, um, do I just keep banging on about it? Yeah, probably do actually, because there's other people who are advertising, um, what's the, what's the thing, <laughs> shit wings? Stop. <laughs> if you put shit and wings together, what would you get? <laughs> Shings? Yeah. Okay. I've got some serviettes in there as well. Well, I'm not sure what I've got here. Oh my days, look at that. There's your wings and ribs. So, last time, different recipe. The wings were, the uh, ribs were done in like individual pieces. And these wings just look pretty romantic. I'd like to see the tips cut off to be fair and then cut into three different bits, cut into the irons and the flats, but it's all good. When they look as pretty as that, you could get away with it. Also, wing lovers out there, Jessica, pan up. <laughs> Wingfest is back on live and tickets are for sale. Friends of the page, 
you love your wings, go and check it out. Right. Oh my. Do you know what? I just gotta pick this up, am I surely? These um <coughs> good sign, good sign. Yeah. That's just a proper piece of of rib, isn't it? Are you really gonna do that? I'm gonna do it, yeah. You did that quite well. It's like rib butter. Please. If you're watching at home now, get in the comments, please. And let me know where you think does the best barbecue style meat like this. I'm telling you. <laughs> that is, oh, my wife. It's juicy. It's sweet. Um, full of moisture. It's tender. You can't cheat the process with this. Do you know what I mean? If you start cutting corners, you can tell in the flavour. These guys are doing it legit. They're doing it properly. Get a wing. Come have a look at this, Jess. Look, you see how the bone just pulls out of these? But. But I'm a food reviewer who kind of specialises in takeaway food, fast food, kind of street food, wings, ribs, burgers, kebabs. I chuff and love it. These guys understand the game. <laughs> well, that yeah, me too. I've got actually got ice. I've got snow on the. What's happened? Look at the look at the caramelisation on that wing. I've got hot sauce on there, I've got seasoning. They're buffalo wings, aren't they? Yeah. That is buffalo sauce. But we'll kind of with their own seasoning on it. Good luck to anyone starting the fast food in this city. Is there any? Yeah, all over your face. Is it really? All over my chops? <laughs> yeah. Is it really? Where? Oh God. Is it? The beard. The beard. Now, I think, there Jess, I'm animal. I think the last box could potentially be my fave. I suppose getting invited to these places is a real perk. I'm just chucking things all over this city. <laughs> Chelmsford, a lot more snow down here than where we live as well, by the way. Here we go. Oh. That is handmade, homemade, not machine made, cheese balls. The legendary dirty fries and the chicken, like goujons, which tenders. Jack tenders, which Jack says is his favorite part of the menu. Let's get him with these chips. I've got pieces of meat on there with pulled meat. Pieces of meat with pulled meat. <laughs> Chorizo. And pulled pork. Oh, nice. Look, that's for it, so there. Strong, spicy, just how I like my women. Anyway, that's just delicious. I chop them. Excuse me. Oh my god. I regurgitated then a little bit in my mouth. <laughs> Like a seagull trying to feed its young. I actually think the food is cleaner today. And uh, I pretty much got stiffy last time I was eating it at Ipswich. These guys are, are very special people. No what? Have I got some on my face? No, it's me. It's so cold. It's make me. My oh, nose is running. Yeah. It's those wings. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a special relationship with this team now. It happens when you uh, review somewhere and it has a, a good impact on them. I'm going to over the moon and invite me down. Right, cheese ball. Get that ball in you. That's what she said. It's literally a cheese ball. <laughs> oh, like an Aaron Cheney type. Stop the bus. <laughs> 
What have I just eaten there? Have a look at that. It's got like a spicy kick to it. Is it? I, have to, I did have chilies on top. Wow. Well, that was some meat. Uh, is this is just not normal takeaway food. What do you think, Jess? Come on, you've been around here every step away with me. Yeah. No, it's just they not what you would normally get from like it's a bit of everything isn't it you don't necessarily have to go to like a chicken shop you don't have to go to a burgers wings burger. and ribs yeah you get everything this is one of those reviews now where i want to go take it in the car and smash your ass out of it what do you think jess i really like looking at them tenders i'll we'll try one come on have a little bite oh did you hear that crunch people mm. that's like a roast beer it's time. Time. Or is it rosemary? I think it might be sage. <laughs> <laughs> it's no. not sage. It's not? No. I don't know. Come here. There we go. That is the aftermath of my review. There's only one thing left to do drink watch fanta fruit twist i'm gonna crack this open um did i even say where we are Chumford. at this pub called the garrison no it's called saccharin's head Sar saccharin's saracen's head <laughs> this is where they're operating from i'll tag it in the video right looking for on a cold day but it's kind of sweet and sexy on the tongue now I loved every part of this for me this is the epitome of what should be expected from um, takeaways as always like look they um, started in the first lockdown on a bus a mad idea on a bus, um, and then they had a few more buses, got big, now they're opening their own kitchen in an amazing pub, when it opens, and this is what they're making from it. I think that they got a 9.3 from us last time. Um, I'm happy to let that stand, but with a massive chuffing gold star on their name. This is, for me, one of my favorite places. If I lived around here, I would be even fatter than I am now. Be smashing this in most nights. <laughs> so there we have it. Burgers, wings and ribs with their new branding, new premises, friends and family of the page. Food Review Club family, if you're watching this, go and give them some support. Give them a thumbs up, get yourself in the comments. Even if it's just to say hi, it would mean the world to me, the world to them and the world and the world to any other foodies out there also trying to do their own thing for their communities in such difficult times. I love you all so much. Thanks so much for the support lately. That, ladies and gentlemen, was another review.